Premier, program director, the Premier of the Eastern Cape, Comrade Oscar Maguyane, members of the executive, family members and colleagues of Umama Dedricks, Kosatu leaders and trade union veterans, stalwarts of our movement led by the ANC and the Alliance. Today we are gathered to honor the memory of a legend who lived and walked this land with great pride, selflessness and humility. Such gatherings are not about reciting verses and tributes, but about drawing inspiration, gathering the best lessons and confronting the reality faced by workers and the millions of our people today here. The history of Mama Lillian Dedricks is the history and lived experiences of South African working class women. The face of excruciating pains and sufferings of our mothers, sisters, and girl children. Kosatu honors with pride the trailblazers of the mighty women shop steward movement, the bedrock of our present day giant of the working class struggles, and the might of the united resistance of our people against apartheid oppression and patriarchy. As a federation, we take this opportunity to salute the government led by the ANC in the Eastern Cape for finally honoring the true legacy of our province, the home of legends and the true face of our struggle, the women of power and the family builders like Umama Dedricks. We are indeed humbled before the Dedricks family for giving us such an outstanding beautiful, intelligent, and fearless fighter, our mother and our leader. She fought and served jail times, including alongside Umama Winimati Gizela Mandela and other legends of our liberation movement. Today, this end, dear comrades, we seek to avoid a hymn book about our stalwarts, but gain insults and ins insights and inspiration to deal with our present day challenges and experiences. In their millions of our people and the working class communities in particular, who suffer the brunt of the vicious triple crisis of poverty, hunger and inequality. We commit to intensify the struggle for which she suffered as a working class leader, a shop steward and a trade union activist in the Food and Canning Workers Union where she was able to also clarify that the struggle of workers is not separate from the struggle we wage in our communities and that for human liberation and justice. These are elements of one struggle. That is what our MDR teaches us. One struggle, many fronts. We honor all who paid the ultimate price for these great ideals. Amongst them, Umama Francis Bard, Umama Florence Matomela, as we remember the power of the song by Umama Miriam Makeba, Kaati, Bashe Zibonke Etilongwini, Bashe Zibonke Kwanongwini. A powerful tribute to the outstanding sacrifices made by all our stalwarts and women of courage. This courage, comrades, we need it when confronting the tragic conditions of our people that our people are faced with when dealing with unemployment, with poverty and inequality, when we deal with hunger, crime and gender-based violence, when we deal with corruption and abuse of public resources. If we could face the might of vicious, racist, murderous regime with such an indomitable spirit, we can't fail in any other cause, only if we invoke the determination that is necessary to act and act decisively. Comrades, the renewal of our movement demands that 2022 is the year of action and united inspiration. We can't fail to defeat poverty. We can't fail to defeat crime and corruption. We can't fail to defeat gender-based violence. We can't fail to end unemployment. These are the words left for us by our legend Umama Dedrix and in her memory let us unite our communities and our people 
Let us build more linguistical integrated communities and cultural diverse societies towards an inclusive and empowering livelihood for all. May this new headquarters of the Eastern Cape province represent more than just a new name, but a new spirit and determination against all odds. May the giant spirit of Mama Dedricks live with us and guide us. Thank you very much.